this video we make a cool looking plant which is growing with the dancing you see in a screen so let's uh, do this so simply these have a system of node network setting so first we make a growing plot animation with the help of geometry node so first of all i turn on the geometry nodes uh, your body is first uh, go for the quadratic bezier here like this bezier here and, uh, and remember don't delete this views at uh, this at the last okay now we uh, go for the uh, curve to mesh because we have a curve so that's why we go for curve to mesh and uh, one more thing uh, change this value to zero final zero this one uh, zero this one and same zero this one and um, uh, this middle value almost 0 0.5 and this value to almost 10 uh, now you see they are straight uh, in a z direction and also looking much more perfect okay uh, so let's uh, go with the other thing uh, because we have curve to match so we go for curve simply curve circle here now apply this profile curve here you see now it's too much big so what we can do uh, decrease their radius uh, so we go for almost okay i think 0 0.1 now is a perfect so we go for 0 0.1 for now so let's make it thick from the top so now we need to set their position so what we can do now we add some sort of nice here uh, so for nice we add a set position node add set position node here okay now we change your offset okay first we go with the nice texture this one okay and remember turn in this into 40 okay. now we add some math node here to maintain the value, you see there now they aren't in a perfect axis. So we go for a vector math node. Okay, we need a two of them, so that's why the first one into subtract and this one into multiply. Okay, and remember this value is 0 0.5. Okay, now you see it came back to its original position. Reduce the scaling amount. Okay. I go for this one. Yeah, this is, might be looking much small cool. Uh, okay, I also decrease the roughness bit. Or uh, okay, I add some sort of roughness here and donor setting to this one. Okay, now this is just looking much more perfect. Now add this multiply node here. Okay, you see now there is uh, a straight value. Yeah, but not a problem. Here we need. Uh, simple supply parameter supply uh, sorry for this so we go for curve parameter okay so then then we find this supply parameter like the factor into this vector now you see yeah we got this now uh, now we make uh, the uh, a thin from a top so simply what we can do now the first thing we uh, need uh, the one more thing we also add a plants here like a leaves okay which uh, you see I hide here now we trim the curve and uh, then further we set the radius okay so we need a trim curve node okay like it here for now just look at the thing okay if I use this just look what's happened okay our mesh is gone so okay for now we go for set curve radius set curve radius this one okay now you doesn't say anything but uh, just wait a while we uh, go for again this supply parameter okay if we shift the this plug the factor into this radius now you see we got a perfect thing which is looking much much more cool yeah yeah this is seriously nice one <laughs> for my animation if you go further then you also map ring this 
okay now this is depend upon you like if you get your buddies want okay like how much you want uh, how much uh, diameter etc how much thickness you want okay but I think this is uh, enough like this from a bottom okay now simply uh, okay like this now we what we need okay now we go for the instance on point and here you buddy see that we have a leaf this is too much big but not a problem i manage this okay i hide this leaf uh, i doesn't show you buddies how to go with this okay like how to okay i'll show you further like what we do next here uh, now simply we go for this curve radius okay okay i think this is uh not looking good from here okay i show you first of all i grab this one a bit more here and we get this one here okay and uh, we need an instance one point now now this is our step to be in this step we growing our leaves okay so here we can now uh, i show you last like what's going on here so first of all uh, there's a leaf okay uh, here we go for simply this one join geometry here a bit more here and like this like this here okay yeah now good geometry to instance don't be panicked uh, from this okay and uh, i show you the value like what we got okay 0 0.009 now you see they are at, at in a perfect place okay now let's go for the further like this rotation value here okay we go for simply align rotation to vector okay like this uh, okay i show you like this rotation value here okay don't be uh, don't like don't play with this okay we just play like they are aligned into their axis now for scaling we do something more like something cool okay for selection we use a boolean selection okay so first of all we okay first of all i think we go for this scaling okay now i i have my own method so that's why First, I okay. Here's the one. Uh, where is this one? Okay. Uh, combine X Y Z. Here is a combine X Y Z vector. This one. Okay. Remember, again, turn this into 0 0.009. I show you like what I wanted here. Now you go for the random value node. Okay. And uh, remember, 0. 0 0 i here this is my perfect values okay uh, if uh, it doesn't work for you guys then you also go with this and i go here from 0 0.003 c22 value to z direction okay now you see like they are a perfect if i unplug this you see like i got this but not a problem i show you at the last like what uh, i got from this okay then yeah, this is why i use because uh, to maintain some leaves here okay uh sorry for this 0 0.003 uh and 0 point 0 point 0 point 0.015 okay now it's looking perfect i think this is a bit spelling mistake from my side and <laughs> uh, now we add here from id okay now for sorry for this first of all i show you uh, I had a math node here. I need two of them. So I shift D this and uh, I also need a supply parameter. Okay, this one. Plug this value into ID. Okay, turn this into multiply, turn this into power, and this factor into this base. Okay, this value here. Okay, now I think uh, we further we go with this but uh, let me show you the one more thing here uh, now it's the time uh, to see the selection uh, like what we do with the selection here so simply here go for the boolean here simply search a random value okay you got from here here the, the settings float to the boolean okay and plug this into the selection now just look at the thing if I increase and decrease probability, there are too much leaves here. Okay, for now I reduce and uh, change their seeds. I go for, I think so. This one. Okay, for now I go for this one. 
Uh, the further more I increase the probability, then this is looking much more cool. Now we go for the rotate instance. Rotate instance. I and S T. Okay, here we got. Simply we go with the pivot point. Okay, like the with the rotation for now. Now your body needs a uh, combine X Y Z node. Okay, and one vector map node and one index net index node. Uh, not vector math, this one math, okay, simple math, and the one more called index node. Here we go, okay. Now, like this here, like this value uh, into Z for now. We go uh, with this, okay. On if we plug into rotation, you just see, like, yeah, we got a perfect random rotation, yeah, and it's also looking much more cool. Uh, if I go with the Y, you see, uh, you can also change here, okay. But I think the, like don't play with the X. Uh, if we play with the Y, just look at here. If I go for some sort of minus four, this is looking much more perfect for now, okay. Uh, so I think this step also done now. So let's go for the other step here. Here, you see, there's a trim curve node now we need because we need animation from here yes so what we do uh, for now i increase uh, here is the boolean here okay here increase the probability okay that you show like then did you see a lot of leaves here okay uh, i go from a start so the first main thing okay i go for the color ramp here okay color ramp here flip these values okay here I simply because uh, I need to play the animation right so what I need here I need a scene time node so scene time you see here seconds in the frames I plug into the seconds here now just look look just look at the thing yeah because I invert these values now you see my plant grow like this now there's a the one more thing you you what you guys think that this is much more fast here yeah? yes you are right so simply what we can do here uh, according to me we go for the math node and the multiply simply math node okay don't add if we add you see then it's uh, like increase our speed more i show you here you see just look at the thing like how fast it's grow but uh, simply come into this multiply reduce this value okay so i go for 0 0.1 okay like okay 0 0.02 now you see yeah looking much more perfect so okay i think we are done from this now it's uh, time to color this so we go for the set position now sorry for this uh set material node uh, plug it simply here and shift it to plug it here i show you why i do this uh, thing so that this isn't working so i go for the newest one okay not a problem uh, set material node here i don't know what they want to ask me but okay uh i, I turn this into the render cycles here into this one uh, for now it's take I think some sort of time to compute here I have this F green leaf okay now you see they are looking much more perfect and this one uh, for their base you can also change this color uh, from a shading view I here I have add on I had HDRI so that's why it look uh, like that here if I add a plane surface and scale it more okay then uh, at last uh, I add some sort of lights here then to show you guys like what the thing we got here now just look at the thing like how it's go I also show you here in this section okay yeah but a much more perfect uh, so guys the thing let me see if the things there's some sort of thing left okay we have I, I left these notes okay now I show you what this group input can do Simply I 
like this here here you see these values the power and exponent etc so first of all i plug this node here okay uh yeah yeah it's just some sort of this but not a problem here i sorry i plug this one here so this is for only single mesh so this is for a multiple meshes so here you see these multiply nodes okay from where i change my plant position like a leaves where it's, uh, where it's grow yes uh, so simply i uh, like the same y like this into the x direction okay not a problem the here you see that our leaves uh, have some sort of different values like they are aren't looking much more perfect but uh, i have some other solution for this so we go for a map ring don't thank god like i go from here so here the bit with the map range okay like this uh, okay i see where i got this uh, value perfectly uh, like i need uh, some sort of bit rotation yeah now this is looking much more perfect guys uh, yes so here i try to play with this random value not okay i think so this is much more so let me see if i increase this 0 0.015 0 0.15 uh, we go for 0 0.0001 if we go bit like 0.003 is it perfect uh, if i go for 0 0.005 yeah this is also good but there's some sort of dis distortion here so i think so that 0.003 is a perfect value for this okay guys uh, our node network settings is totally complete so have a look in this node network setting okay i also bit uh, zoom at this section to show you guys perfectly okay just look at the here uh, so we are done with this guys uh, you see uh, so for the further animation uh, i render this and show you guys what the thing i got at the last uh, the one more thing I show you here, uh, the shaders, okay? So I show you from where I do, the, like, like from where I play with the shaders, not... Okay, for now it doesn't say anything, yes? Mm, I go with this shader, this is for stamp, okay? If I want, I go with the brownish. Okay, I also show you in a render cycle, just with a bit, okay? You see here, this is a bit brownish. Now this will depend upon you, like if you add uh, some sort of nice texture here, uh, okay nice texture, now if you go for the, some sort of 4D, and not in this one, we uh, go for simply the roughness, okay, and uh, add some sort of more values here, like scaling etc, and uh, do play with your displacement, okay, and so then you got uh, this much more perfect. And the one more thing we for these green leaves you see we i apply texture simply if you have a node a wrangler add-on uh, okay simply come here and simply search uh, uh, node wrangler okay and then on this simply if you came here so simply uh, shift uh, alt shift d press and then uh, alt shift t press and then you got this and then you apply your textures here which you download it and then they give you such, such, such type of thing okay so at last i show you the render animation at the gpu compute i reduce the sample bit to uh, 16 okay some sort of 16 this is my uh, this is my camera preview just have a look uh, if i scale this bit like this one i think so don't think so enough okay but the thing uh, i got it at last just have a look perfectly so this is the thing guys so guys thank you so much for watching if you i hope you like our video and enjoying this animation and i hope that this lecture is uh, much helpful for you so subscribe our channel and like our video so see you soon in the next video guys take care allah peace